Good day everyone. Today I'm going to discuss to you the quadrilaterals. By definition, quadrilateral is a polygon with four sides or simply a four-sided polygons. We have different kinds of quadrilateral. We have first the trapezoid. Trapezoid, it is a quadrilateral with exactly one pair of parallel sides. So if we're going to draw a trapezoid, can be like this one. Okay. So this side is parallel to this one. They are pair, but not necessarily that they are equal. They are just parallel. Trapezium, a quadrilateral that has no parallel sides. So if we're going to draw a trapezium, that can be like this one. Okay, notice in our diagram or illustration, there is no parallel, parallel side in our trapezium. Next is parallelogram. A parallelogram is a, uh, a parallelogram is a quadrilateral. Okay, let's change this to quadrilateral with two pairs of parallel sides. So if we're going to draw, so it can be like this one. This side or this side is parallel to this one or this is parallel to this one. So two pairs of parallel sides. Rectangle, it is a parallelogram with four right angles. So four right angles, we're going to draw a rectangle. So this is 90, 90, 90, and 90. And it is a parallelogram, therefore, this side is parallel to this one, and this side is parallel to another side. And of course, rectangle, opposite sides are equal. So this side is equal to the measure of the other side, and this one to this one. Rhombus. A parallelogram with four congruent sides. So, four congruent sides. Okay, so this side is equal to the other. All sides are equal. And a square, a parallelogram with four equal sides and angles. So, a, com a square is a combination of a rectangle and a rhombus. So, all the measure of the angles is 90 degrees, then all the sides are congruent or equal. So those are the kinds of quadrilaterals. Now we have the schematic diagram of quadrilateral. So quadrilateral, we have here the trapezium, that means no sides are parallel. Trapezoid, one pair of parallel side. Then the parallelogram, two pairs of parallel sides. So no pair of parallel sides, one pair of parallel side, and two pair of parallel sides. Under our parallelogram, we have the rectangle. Rectangle, all the angle measures 90 degrees. Or all the angles is equal or are equal. Rhombus, all sides are congruent. And under the rectangle and rhombus, we have the square. Now, how, how now let us use this schematic diagram to answer these problems. Complete each statement with the word always, sometimes, or never. For always, let us use the capital letter A, sometimes for capital letter S, and, and capital letter N for never. A trapezoid is black, a quadrilateral. Trapezoid is always a quadrilateral because a trapezoid has four equal or oh, four sides. A square is blank a rhombus. A square is always a rhombus. All sides of a rhombus are blank congruent. Always congruent. 
A rectangle is blank or rhombus. A rectangle is sometimes a rhombus. Number five, a square is blank or rectangle. A square is always a rectangle. A rectangle is blank or square. A rectangle is sometimes a square. Last, we have a square is blank or parallelogram is always a parallelogram. Thank you for watching Senior Pablo TV.